Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel, Lay TV. This is Teacher Lay once again for another uh, learning video uh, for this week. Okay, so we'll not stay long here. Let's go! Okay, so here now we are in the... We're seeing the logo of our school. Brad Burana School. Welcome to our English class for this episode. And most of our lessons, uh, I'm getting it from the book that we're using in our school, which is the English for Daily Life. Okay. So, as you can see, we have the chef. So you know or you have the idea what we're going to talk about in this episode. So we're going to cook. Let's see. Let's uh, learn or know one by one the different ingredients that we can use in our cooking lesson. First one is chili powder. Chili powder. Hi people. Loves using this because they love hot and spicy. Next is sugar. Sugar makes food makes our food sweet or a bit sweet. And then we have MSG. Some people are using this to spice up their food. MSG or the short for monosodium glutamate. Then we have the salt. Salt, pepper, or the black pepper, the garlic powder, garlic powder, flour, flour, and milk, or the this kind of milk is um, evaporated or evaporated milk. And we have ketchup. Ketchup. And we have the fish sauce. Fish sauce. So if you think um, we need to add more salt or make it salty, we can use also fish sauce. Then we have butter or butter. And we have oil. For this kind of oil, cooking oil. And then we have vinegar. Vinegar. Then we have soy sauce. Soy sauce. And then egg or eggs. We also use onion onion and then we use lemongrass lemongrass water water some of our cooking we also use hot dog hot dog children love this and Lemon, lemon. Sometimes we also use tomato, tomato, tomato. It depends uh, whether it's British or American English. Then we have shrimp, shrimp. And chili, chili. Okay, so the chef, let's find out what will the chef, uh, we're gonna cook. It's cooking time, part one. Let's find out what he's going to cook. Okay, so, okay, so let's cook fried egg. Let's fry some fried egg. Let's fry some fried egg. Well, let's cook fried egg. So what... What are we going to use? We need some oil. Oil. There you go, the oil. 
And then we have some eggs. There you go, the eggs. And then we need some salt. Salt. Salt to taste. Too much, not too little. We need some pepper or the black pepper. Okay, it depends on your taste buds, how you want it to be. Okay, I think we're done cooking fried eggs. So we will add more to it to make it more delicious. Let's put some ketchup. There you go, the ketchup. Right. Now it's ready. Let's try. Hmm, delicious. All right. So that's the fried egg. We're going to the part two of our cooking time. Cooking time part two. Let's find out. So now in our second part, we're going to cook fried chicken. Fried chicken. Okay. We love fried chicken. So what are we going to use? We need some flour. There you go, the flour. And then we need some garlic powder. Garlic powder to make it more delicious. There you go, the garlic powder. And we need some salt. Of course, every, uh, most of the food are being added with salt to make it uh, taste better. Uh, food without salt. And then we need some pepper or the black pepper. Okay, there are white and black pepper. And then what else? We need some chili powder. Okay, chili powder to make it a little bit hot and spicy. So it depends on you how how can you stand. Okay, the hotness or the spiciness of your food. We need some oil. Oil. Okay, so we're going to heat the oil to prepare uh, frying the chicken. And let's fry the chicken now. See the chicken, it's ready to go. Oh, there you go. So we'll wait, we'll wait a little bit and it's done. Okay, our chicken, our fried chicken is done. So, what are we going to do to make it more tastier? So, we will add, or let's add some ketchup. There you go, the ketchup. Okay, is it ready to eat? Ready to be eaten? Oh, it's good to eat now. Now, let's try. Delicious! Alright, so we're done cooking fried chicken. Let's find out. It's cooking time, part three. Let's see what uh, will the chef uh, gonna cook. Right. Okay, so we're going to cook tom yum. So first thing is we're going to. Add some water. Let's add some water. See the water there. Then we're going to add some lemon juice. Let's add some lemon. All right. Next is we're going to. Add some onion.
And then we're going to add or let's add some tom yum nor cubes. Okay, make our tom yum taste better. And yeah, let's add some tomato. Tomato. And then let's add some shrimps, the most important shrimps. And then let's add some chili. chili. So it depends how strong can you bear the spiciness or the hotness of your tom yum. And then let's add some salt course to taste so to taste and let's add some msg msg and let's add some chili powder okay. chili powder so you can can you imagine how spicy it is how hot it is and then we're going to add some lemon Lime. They also use lime as a substitute to lemon. All right, let's add some milk or the evaporated milk. Then let mmm, I think we're good. It smells good already. So when it smells good, it is surely uh, delicious. So it's done. Now let's try. Mmm, surely it's delicious. All right. So we're done cooking. Let's review the ingredients that we usually use inside the kitchen. First thing is we use chili powder, sugar, MSG, salt, pepper. So there are two kinds of pepper, uh, the black pepper and the white pepper. And then the garlic powder. Ketchup, fish sauce. Wow, do you remember all the ingredients? Butter. Some of the ingredients here we did not use, but most of these are being used inside the kitchen. Flour, milk, or the evaporated milk. We have the cooking oil. Vinegar, vinegar, soy sauce, soy sauce, then eggs, eggs, onion, onion, most of our cooking we used onion, lemongrass, and then we have, of course, the chicken, chicken. Some people use nor cubes flavoring to make the strong flavoring of the meat. Shrimp, shrimp, and tomato, tomato, the lemon or the lime. Hot dog, hot dog. And we have chili. Chili, the very common in Thailand and in others, uh, Southeast Asia part. And of course, the water. Most of our food, we use water to cook it. So these are the ingredients that we normally use. So that's it for our episode. If you like uh, our lesson today or in this episode, please don't forget to Click subscribe, like, and you can drop some comments down below. So I will know if you have any suggestion that I can improve myself.
So that's it, everyone. Thank you for watching. See you next. See you on my next video. Bye.